Hi, um, this will be the video guide for the 360 Alien Planet template, which is um, the, it's also the Skybox template. Um, you can see in our preview video that the idea is that this is a texture that encompasses a 360 view. Um, so as you move the camera around, you can see more of the environment. Um, this preview is the sky, but any of the environment previews will also work. It's just that the sky camera moves the most, so it lets you see the most, uh, most of the map. Uh, within this template, there's also portrait segmentation. So if we switch to a person, you can see that they are segmented into the scene. So if you have the camera facing yourself, you should be uh, present in the scene, in, in your virtual scene that's set up with this uh, skybox. So if we go over to the hierarchy, it's super simple. Um, we have our AR tracking group, which has an AR camera and an attached skybox. Um, this is the skybox, as you can see, pretty cool. Uh, and that uh, skybox material is attached to a simple cube. Now we have our skybox parented under the AR camera so that the cube moves with the camera. Otherwise, there's a risk that our skybox will stop rendering if, if the camera loses sight of this cube. Because it's parented, it will follow the camera, uh, therefore making sure your skybox is always visible. We also have this uh, portrait segmentation group, which is very simple. It's just um, the portrait segmentation that you can add from here, uh, this one, and I've removed the backgrounds so that it looks like you're uh, on this alien planet. Now, if we go to the assets, uh, we can see that we have our skybox material, which was created by navigating to the material tab and adding a simple skybox, um, and then applying our own texture to it. So in this case, it's our alien nightscape. But we've also included an alien dayscape. Um, so we can navigate to our alien planet material and change it to the dayscape texture. And now we're on our planet during the day. You can also import your own cube maps by going to the Add Asset, Import, and then Cube Map. It's its own special section. Um, so this will allow you to import a cube map that can be used by the Skybox material. And that's it. It's a super simple template. Um, hopefully, people can figure out how to use it. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, let me know. Thanks.